Hi, I'm Quinn and welcome to my channel. Today we are working on the 8th day in the November countdown. The artist of this is this person here. I need to get that into focus. Oh, no, is it? Oh. Oh. Is that with the Etsy link and as with all my other videos on this that will be in the description so yeah I am playing catch up again because I had to take today is the 10th but I had to take break because my wrist was really hurting me and I just, I couldn't do anything. It's still a little sore, but if I think, I feel like if I sit here doing nothing much longer, I'm going to go insane. I have to keep my brain busy, otherwise it acts up on me. Because that is the joys of mental health. If I let it do its own thing and think, it doesn't do nice thinking. So I opt to keep as busy as possible with creative things. I have been playing Animal Crossing and some other video games. I currently am decorating my Animal Crossing island, like terraforming it and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, I have been getting a bit stressed out making videos because for some reason well not for some reason i know why youtube likes to turn my comment section on here off and there's really nothing i can do about it until i reach a certain amount of subscribers because from what i've been told once I reach a certain amount of subscribers, I can appeal and have that stop. But until then, sorry, I'm grabbing a pencil. Until then, I just have to keep turning them off, turning them back on again. And apparently, once I've reached a certain amount of comments, the algorithm will stop turning it off. So yeah, there's just that struggle with with that that's been bugging me. And one of my videos has gotten a copyright strike. I do not know where that clicking is coming from. I hope that it's not being picked up by my microphone. I get something tapping on the underside of my desk. So yeah, one of my videos has been copyright striked. Well, not striked. Somebody has put a claim that the music on the video is theirs, but it's not. Um. My partner edits all of my videos and the music that he's using is like a royalty 3 made for content creators for streaming and stuff. Well, you, you can use it on YouTube videos as well, but 
somebody has claimed that it is their music and my understanding is that it's not because the person who made the track is not the person that has claimed copyright on the track so that's got me a little bit annoyed as well but other than that I've been doing quite well I am currently looking for a villager on Animal Crossing, one of the new ones and Orville is not being very pleasant he keeps taking me to islands that do not have the villager I'm looking for on but hopefully doing some time travel, naughty naughty I can uh, find the villager that I'm looking for I have like a certain type of like villager that I like to get I, I like to get ones that look very like um, cottage quarry looking and I have a I have a thing for lazy villagers. I, I love having lazy villagers on my island. One of my favourite villagers is is Sherb. He's a little he's a little blue goat. And he's an absolute baby. And the current villager that I'm looking for is also a lazy villager. So I'm hoping that I can find them because it would be nice to have them but obviously even the time travelling because so I've currently time travelled back to the start of the day just so that I can have a little break so I can record and just take a break from yelling at poor Orville Pretty much what I've done today is just yell at the poor little dodo for not taking me to the island that I need. But yeah, if you play Animal Crossing, do you have a favourite villager? Do you have a villager that you prefer? Like I said, for me it's Sherb. And anything that would look good in like a a naturey like cottage core kind of island. If seeing my island is something you'd be interested in, leave a comment in the comment section. Cause comments really help with keeping the uh, comments switched on. Apparently the algorithm will stop turning my comments off after I've reached a certain amount of of comments so yeah if you fancy helping me out and leaving a comment I need to put some glitter on this frog like I've said in previous videos I don't have a very exciting like chatty things to chat about because I don't go out much if at all um, due to mental health and stuff I am a kind of little hermit just living my little hermit life I chat to friends on on Discord and stuff, and just live a very quiet, slow existence. And we have finished this little frog. 
There we go. We call glittery. Focus a bit. I turn auto focus off, so I have to do that all manually. So otherwise, it jumps all over the place. So yeah, there is day six, eight. That's eight. I can't count. That is day eight done. I'm going to go and do the recording for day nine because yeah. Well, thank you for watching, and I hope that you're all having a great day, even though you're probably watching this on a different day to what I'm recording it at, because it won't go live today. But yeah, I hope everybody's doing great. I know sometimes winter and stuff can be a bit difficult on people. I know it can be difficult on me. So... I know there are others that struggle in winter time. But yeah, this is all of my little squares so far. And I've been keeping like up with Instagram and seeing everybody else's and everybody else is posting really amazing squares too. Um also I forgot to mention at the start of this video, sorry. This is a community colour along with Bex and Books. So yeah, this is a colour, a community colour along kind of thing and I just decided to join in and make mine into videos for my channel. But yes, thank you for watching. If you have a book, not not this, but if you have like a book that you've seen like in one of my haul videos or seen in one of my finished pages and you'd like to do, to do a buddy colour, uh, leave me a message in the in on Instagram or in the comment section and we can arrange that I really like doing buddy colors so yeah thank you for watching I'm rambling now so I'm just going to end the video <laughs> thank you for watching and I shall see you in the next video bye